everyone, it's Andrea and welcome back to the channel. So I recently saw this book on um, Facebook, I think it was on an, a book page, something like that anyway, and it's the Bookish Colouring Book, a colouring book for bookworms, Creations by Hallow. So this is the, 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 this is me, very much the camera, not so much a cat, but I don't mind cats, and the back is just blank, I'll have a quick sip of water and we'll have a quick look through this book. These are really simple designs in the most part. So, so it, it, as you can see, it says 2020 red at the top here, but that's okay. <coughs> Books are a girl's best friend. Mm -hmm. I'm a book and coffee kind of queen. I'm more tea, but I, I get the sentiment. These I don't like so much because you can't see them. It says book, coffee, sweater, repeat. Again, replace coffee with tea, I'd be there. But it's too, it's nothing to do with books. Where's this one? Just books and a mug. And that's actually got a tea bag in it, because, yeah. And again, this has nothing really to do with books. It just says bookaholic, which you can barely read. Bookish, again, nothing to do with books. These are the ones I'm not that keen on. But like this one, books are my happy place. I quite I can do I like that one. This one, which is the cover picture, bookshelf goals. I love this one. Girl reading a book. So they're very simple. Like I said, they're, they're not. They're just going to be. I'm going to sit here and just colour straight with markers and have a laugh. That's quite a nice one. Happiness is a cup of cup of tea in a book. Keep calm and read your favourite book. Again, that's quite nice because the books are there and there's a little fox reading the book. Just one more chapter. I would have, have liked that to have been slightly different, but I like the, the saying. To read or not to read? What a stupid question. It's like a very simple design to colour in. Read or read. If you, if you want something to do but you're not feeling too in depth so it must be something I just pick up in the evening while I'm watching TV read it and it's just and you write your favorite book titles on them readers live a thousand lives again very true so many books so little time again very true there should be so many coloring books so little time <laughs> yeah that's me that was me when I bought my Harry Potter collection because I bought all, all the books in one go all the complete series in Waterstones in one go. I had money for some reason. I don't know where I got it from. Saved it up, I think. And I just went and bought every single book in hardback. Books are magic. Again, very true. That one's all right. Not all those who wander who are, not all those who wander are lost. The world belongs to those who read. Read. And then again here we've got books, we've got a notebook, we've got a pen, we've got a candle, we've got a cup of tea, and it actually says tea on the tea bag. <laughs> so yes. So like it's a very, very simple book. That's it. That's all that's in it. Very, very simple book. I will leave a link if I can find them down below. I got mine from Amazon UK. If I can find it on Amazon US, I'll put a link below if you want it. I'm not an Amazon affiliate. They're just there for your convenience. Um, if you so wish, you don't have to. It's not going to bother me. Um, so I hope you've enjoyed this uh, little flip through of Bookish, a colouring book for bookworms. Um, I'll see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.